she went to the airport in San Diego and went through the security because she flies so much she gets what they call a TSA pre-check which means she doesn't have to take her computers out and she doesn't have to take her shoes off she likes that a lot so she's moving along through and she put her bags onto the conveyor belt and she had a very strong impulse to move quickly because there were people coming from different places and to get into that machine that will check her for metal but she had that impulse and then she hesitated from it so she wasn't sure which impulse came from where she wasn't sure if the impulse to move along quickly was from source or from somewhere else and she didn't have time to sort it out before she really had no choice and a man stepped in front of her and went through and she thought to herself that's really interesting because she knew something was up with it she just didn't know what it was so she walked through and the beeper went off now there was no metal on her it was a random search of electronics and Esther laughed as they took her two bags to be searched because she had in her bag two computers an iPad two iPod the recorder this microphone this microphone she had five different garage door clickers because she's moving from one place to another five sets of car keys her own cell phone a bag full of wires and chargers and so she stood in front of the young woman who was about to go through her bags and she said to her my thoughts and prayers are with you <laughs> because she knew there was a lot going on here now Esther had plenty of time she had an hour before she was boarding and so she didn't really mind the process it was a little disconcerting to see everything that matters to her strewn all over the table and one piece at a time the woman is wiping them all down it took 15 minutes maybe a little bit longer so Esther is standing there and sort of relaxing into it a little bit and she is asking herself because she's not allowed to touch anything and so she just stood back and she's watching the process she also had jewelry she's watching the process and she's thinking to herself it's attraction 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 everything is attraction and then she thought well nothing terrible is happening here and then the young woman said to her why do you have all of this <laughs> and Esther said oh I'm on my way I'm going to be conducting a seminar what about <laughs> well it's about law of attraction and the woman went crazy because she knows about law of attraction she's read these books she was so delighted to have a really up close experience <laughs> with Esther and then it all came to Esther Esther said you know I've been standing here trying to figure out what was in my vibration that would cause me to have this delayed experience have all of this happen all of this which I've been considering something not wanted so I was wondering what's going on with me that I would attract this and then Esther smiled and said and I'm delighted to discover that my attraction was you my attraction was you this lovely girl who wants to understand who was more the attractor of Esther even than Esther was the attractor of her although that's never an accurate statement is it because whatever comes is always equally attracted nothing accidental ever happens